Hi and welcome to Old School Blues Guitar. It is time for the classic blues turnaround of the month for January, February, March 2017. This month we're going to take a look at a couple cool turnarounds in the key of A. If you're playing a shuffle or even a slow blues and you need a turnaround to play an A, the place to go is Eddie Taylor. And Eddie Taylor did a lot of shuffles and even slower tunes in the key of A where he does these really neat turnarounds. I'm going to focus on a tune called Bad Boy which is one of my favorite Eddie Taylor tunes. And in this song, which is a shuffle in the key of A, at almost every point in the song where he does a turnaround, he does something a little different. But he plays it basically over the long A, which is a typical Eddie Taylor thing. So the song is a shuffle. So when it starts out in the, you know, the first verse over the one, he's playing the... to the turnaround, he does these single string type things, playing in A, but up or down here on, up here on the neck, down here on the neck, down here on the neck instead of up. And so a lot of times if you're doing a Jimmy Reed, Eddie Taylor type shuffle in A, the easiest place to go is right here for your turnaround, which is a typical Jimmy Reed type thing. Of course, Eddie Taylor played that stuff on the Jimmy Reed records. But Eddie Taylor a lot of times would do these single string runs and the first verse of Bad Boy he does this. Back into the verse. So that's the first turnaround I want to show you. Starts out sliding. I hear the slide. Could be a hammer on from the third to the fifth fret of the second string. I think it's a slide. And then, one, two, three, four, with the first finger on the third fret of the first string and hammering on to the fifth fret of the first string. And then back to the third fret. So the whole thing. And then back to the fifth fret of the second string. That's the first lick. And an easy way to learn this, this turnaround is to just break it down into three parts. This is the first part. And then he's going to come down here. And this is A. You could play a little solo in the key of A on the second and third strings. I'm going to the, coming to the first fret of the second string and hammering on to the third fret. So the whole thing. And then back to the first fret of the second string to the third string second fret second fret of the third string all the way through and then an open A. Now Eddie Taylor played with a thumb pick and a, it is a pick on his first finger country blue style so he probably would get that bass now with this thumb and what I'm doing is just use a, a flat pick here since a lot of guys play with the flat pick so let's do the whole thing so far and then, right away after that open A, he's going to get an open 6 string, an open E. And then he's going to do this little lick over E7. So he's basically playing over that chord. And he's, what he's doing is getting an open E, and he's going to hammer on with the first finger on the first fret of the third string. Open first string. And he does a couple variations on this in the tune, and I'll probably get it mixed up. But the first one I think he does is like this. So. Back to the song. So it's open sixth string, hammering on the first fret of the third string, and then the open first string. He's going to drop a pinky in or a ring finger on the third fret of the second string, which is the seventh. A little band. And then a couple open E's to wrap it up. Try it again. And then back to the one. So that is the first example of an Eddie Taylor turnaround in A. One more time, slowly.
Let's try it one more time. And then back into the into the one. Bad boy. He does a little variation on this, and this one's kind of tough. I'm trying to memorize it and look at it off the tab, but he does something like this. In fact, I got that timing wrong. It's he does that little lick, and then a little variation on that E seventh lick. So let me try it one more time. on that same, he's playing in the same areas, but he's just doing something a little different. And what he's doing is starting out with the third fret of the first string. Slight bend, and then open. And then he's going third fret, first fret on the second string. Open first string. And he's going to wind up again on the second fret of the third string. Then he's going to hammer on and pull off. Alright, we hammer on the second fret of the fourth string and then play the open fourth string. And then go to the third fret of the fifth string, open, and then a long A chord. So let me play that slowly. Instead of you've got this. Here's the variation. When he does the E seventh, the first time he does this. The second time it's just a slight little rhythmic thing. But what makes this cool is every time he does a turnaround in the song, it's slightly different, which is really creative. It's always kind of boring when every turnaround is, which you hear a lot of guys do. You know, mix it up, be creative, expand your playing. When I play a tune, I try to sometimes play something different every turnaround. You know, all the fills make it different. Don't repeat the same thing, but you got to do it in such a way it doesn't sound like that's what you're trying to do. It's got to work. So for this Eddie Taylor slow shuffle in A, when you get to the turnaround, here's two things you can do. The first one, and then the second one, let me play that second one again. I was kind of thinking about what I was doing. So it's... To the song again. So there are two examples of Eddie Taylor turnarounds in the key of A. If you're playing acoustic, you could even use those turnarounds playing acoustic. And sometimes I do some shuffles on my acoustic, you know, with my brother who's playing harmonica, and I'll use those Eddie Taylor turnarounds if we're playing in, in A. Now, another one which is a lot simpler, it's just this is from another tune. I'll throw this one in while we're here. It's from my favorite Eddie Taylor tune, which is called Stop Breaking Down. And in that, he does something like this. And he's just doing this. That kind of thing, where he's just walking down the bass string. Starting on the second fret of the third string. Again, we're in the key of A. So one, two, three, four, like this. Same idea. Open. Third string, and then second fret of the fourth string, hammer on, open, so like this. Third fret of the fifth string, which is the A, and then open. And then you could wrap it up with the open E, and play some variation there. So I'm just doing So if I was playing the same tune, Bad Boy, I could use that turnaround as well. 
I, I don't think he uses it exactly like that. Now, in Bad Boy, a lot of times when he gets over the five... <laughs> that kind of lick when the tune is over the four, right before the turnaround. But anyway, sometimes he uses that just as a straight turnaround. And he does some different variations on that. Get on YouTube, listen to Eddie Taylor's Bad Boy, and see if you can see all the variations. And if you use these ideas that I've taught you right here, that should be enough to figure out pretty much anything you hear on that tune. Stop Breaking Down has some great turnarounds in, in A as well. Hope you enjoyed this lesson. I will be back again in a few months with another classic electric blues or acoustic blues turnaround. Until then, I will see you later.